development towards the industrialization of Sadat. Our, uh, our desire is very clear as Sadak would like to transform the lives of the people. And transformation of people comes through transformative industrialization and that will build our economies and achieve our industrialization targets of 2063. Here are the objectives of the Sadak industrialization work. And they include, among other issues, the need to popularize the SADAC industrialization strategy roadmap that is from 2025 to 2063, and identify industrialization projects that can be implemented jointly by the public and private sectors within SADAC member states. The second objective is to spread knowledge among SADAC community at large, including governments, the private sector, academia, research institutions, and think tanks, members of the public, and so forth, to ensure wider understanding and acceptability of SADAC industrialization strategy and roadmap of 2015 to 2063. We also wish to use the SADAC industrialization with platform to build coalitions to ensure understanding and cooperation among stakeholders on how to implement this industrialization strategy, including the development of regional value chains Examples of value chains that are important to the industry include pharmaceuticals, mineral beneficiation, and agro-processing. And this is what we see, all of us, is our comparative and competitive advantage. And we would like to work as a community to deliver economic development to our people and also position our region as a region to recognize within the international community of regions. I now want to turn over and speak to the program itself. The SADC Industrialization Week will be held over six days from the 28th of July to the 2nd of August 2024 with the private sector businesses exhibiting during the war period. I want at this stage to just go back and emphasize the responsibility or division of labor between private and public, government and private sector. Um, the SADAC industrialization work is a private sector.